Hey everybody, it's Cheryl, lead off leash canine training. And I have Hazel and Wrigley and Tioga and Noodles. And we are just having a nice downtown structured walk. And I wanted to talk to you for a minute about the concept of muzzles because muzzles can really help a dog that's struggling with reactivity or aggression, whether it's towards animals or other dogs. So in this case with Noodles, she struggles with um, other dogs and high prey drive. And she only really struggles with her dogs when there's a little stuffed animal. A little stuffed animal and the dog wants, the other dog wants to go near it. She really just wants to attack that dog. And she has great obedience. She's been through my program about six months ago. And I have said to the owners, you know, you just, she's a management case. I can't bring her the rest of the way. She needs a really solid pack of dogs. And I don't have that resource right now. So right now, I've got her back for a little reboot. I've got her around some great dogs that are non-reactive. And so I've been able to push her a little bit into different situations. My point being is the muzzle. If people are afraid to put the muzzle on the dog, then the dog is at risk. Think of it as teaching your new puppy, I have an itch, sorry, teaching your new puppy to use a leash. You would never just not leash a puppy because they didn't like it. Oftentimes puppies will pancake and they won't move and you work them through it. Dogs can be conditioned to anything. So you just have to think of the um, muzzle as a piece of daily attire. And just like the leash in a puppy, keeping them safe from getting in the street, this muzzle will keep her safe from being reactive to other dogs and allows her to be out in the environments and places that could sort of trigger her and she gets to work through it and everybody's safe. So don't worry what people think. If anything, I think most people are thinking, wow, look at that, a real responsible dog owner. So that's my two cents on muzzles. Use them. It's better than the alternative, which often can be euthanasia for dogs. So put the muzzle on, practice putting your dog in situations that might um, trigger them. But before you do all that, give them some really good obedience and good solid heel and place and recall so they know what to be doing. All right, thanks for watching everybody. It's Cheryl and Hazel and Wrigley and Noodles and Tioga in beautiful downtown Durango by the river. We're at 70 degrees. We love this weather. Have a great day, everybody. Bye.